Hello everyone, it's me Page of Maces and welcome back to Sidely Vanilla on the 5th Joy server. Um, well, it's been a while. I am really sorry that it's taken me so long to get back into this, but um, for those of you that don't know, I was in a pretty bad accident two weeks ago, more or less. Um, I fell down, or I slipped on an escalator on the London Underground um, on my way home from work and I ended up dislocating my knee. So while I've been home all this time I haven't really been in the mood to do any recording. Like not really feeling all that great mentally, in pretty bad pain physically and a bunch of other fun things. But now I'm trying to get back into the swing of things because I know if I keep neglecting YouTubes I will just then stop doing it altogether, and that's not what I want to do. There's my banner. This was all fancified, I don't remember this. It's been a while since I've been on though. <laughs> but I'm healing up well, I think. I've recently had a new brace put on. Um, for those of you that do not know, for do that don't know, um, you don't recover straight away from a knee dislocation. Um, I'm looking at possibly three months recovery time. But that's like fully recovered. I can go back to work and stuff way before then. It's just like worst case scenario kind of thing. Like my knee's all puffy and horrible and swollen and I can't walk on it without crutches but um... I need to fix my Optifine thing. <laughs> but yeah, recovering slowly. New brace on which allows me to actually move my knee slightly. But I will be alright eventually. Just need time to recover and do the things I enjoy rather than just sitting here playing Adventure Capitalist all the time and a bunch of other stuff. Um, I actually want to do something rather than just talk about my tragic accident that has left me <laughs> left me sitting on my bed for most of the day. Uh, where shall I hang this? Maybe here. I give each of you in the comments three guesses as to what that is. If you're SMRT, you will get it. Now I had a crap chest somewhere full of stuff. Oh yeah, um, I guess I could give you a quick house tour because this is going to be my Who Is episode. Seeing as <laughs> Dolin started a thing, so yeah. Who is Page of Maces? Well, apart from being injured, Page of Maces. Um, I can't really refer to myself in third person, that's just weird. Okay. Um, my name is Lucy. Don't get freaked out, Paige is not my real name, even though Paige is a name. Um, I live in London, and been into gaming since I was pretty young. Uh, my dad's always enjoyed it, as in, he, as in he really liked strategy games. One time we spent about, he spent about two weeks playing Postal Diplomacy, and we had, we could not use our dining room table because he just had the board there for ages and <laughs> mum got very cross with him but that was very funny this is a uh... and then the armor thing this little cool trick that Cor taught me with the uh, with string this is looking more and more like a proper skyrim house pardon me um so yeah, basically brought up with board games. I'm probably very lucky to have had a dad who didn't really care that I was a girl, in a way, because um, he just taught me the same games that he taught my brother to play, so I was never like excluded or anything like that. He was pretty much an equal opportunity gamer. We'd, I'd play the same games as my brother. My favourite game from childhood is probably Talisman. So that's the game I remember the most. I've also had a really good idea for this, so um, we will make that while I waffle. 
my end chest is upstairs. Um, that's pretty much like um, that. Um, other games that I say were quintessential from my childhood. Legend of Zagor is another one of them. Basically this um, kind of RPG-ish game where you could uh, pick between four different classes and the guy would act, the um, like the dungeon guy would actually talk to you. One memorable occasion was when we were on holiday in um, in the Lake District. There you go, that kind of looks like a butter churn now, don't you think? If we could get a trap door under that. If I could get picks to help me with that, then maybe that would work out. Hmm. Hmm. I'll have to ask him. Um. One memorable time when we were in the Lake District, which is a place in England where, uh, when I was on holiday with my family, we were just randomly sitting there having dinner, then suddenly from the other room where we've been playing this game, we go, Wizard! You cowardly worm! Come to the treasure chamber! Ra ha 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 ha! So we, and that freaked my grandpa out and we were all laughing and things like that. Um, I didn't actually play any video games until I was fairly, uh, quite a bit older. Hello. Can't really trade much with him. And we need to find a better way to keep him in. I didn't really play any video games until I was like a, a teenager. Um, or... A, or just as a tween, because my dad bought a computer for us and he taught me how to play Civilization 2, Command and Conquer, and The Secret of Monkey Island. Until mum got cross that he was keeping me up too late and uh, he put it, he stopped gaming with me, which is very sad. Um, but I think like Pix, my first game that I ever played was um, Sonic 2 because my uncle had a Sega thing. I'm not very good with the old consoles because I never played on any of them apart from the Sega thing that Sonic was on. I only ever played that for like half an hour to an hour at a time when my mum was cleaning their houses. I want to try to build something. What do, what do? What need, what need? Uh, that will do for the moment. Yep, me and Carl, we're dating now. If any of you guys hadn't realised it yet, we are we are totally dating. It's almost two months now. That's also another thing I am. I am Carl's girlfriend. I hope you don't mind me saying that, Carl. But uh, I think pretty much everyone knows now, even though we're kind of... We're not keeping it quiet, we're just, you know... Not constantly reminding everyone on Twitter and uh, other places. People know. Um, but yeah. So yeah, played a bit of Sonic. Uh, my friends... Ooh. One of my friends who is the guy that got me into Minecraft, he also had like quite a lot of games growing up. So we played Age of Empires at his. We... Um, ooh, Wild Pumpkins also played uh, like the sim he got me into the sims like, uh, he had all the expansion packs and lent them all to me when I needed them hello Zumble. I shot you in the knee which is fitting seeing as I live in a Skyrim house um, so that's kind of like my gaming history Both mostly brought up uh, in games by my dad Although, I do occasionally play card games, which my mum is, is much better than my dad at. She will always win Canasta. Pretty much. Unless my brother wins it and she gets cross. No one in my family really likes losing. Seems a good a place as any to build it. Um... What else can I say about me? There's not really much like I can say really. So, like, I never went to university. My job I work uh, which is a big department store in London. Um handling online orders and stuff like that. Um 
Yeah. <laughs> I think I've like talked about myself quite a lot, so I'm kind of struggling for things to say. Mostly because I have been at this for a long while, but I'm guessing a refresher a refresher is good. Um got two cats called George and Jenna who are both incredibly adorable and sometimes the bane of my life. George especially has been harassing me for food in the morning despite the fact that I can't really get up and up until recently I couldn't go downstairs to feed him but and I still can't feed him because his food is in a cupboard that I can't bend down to get into so all he does is stand on my knee and make me feel bad so we want one there and hang on I should probably have started in the middle. Yep, here we go. Yep, three is good enough, I think. Got no signs. Plenty of wood, though. So yeah, George is a, a big pain in the ass. Um, so I suppose address the elephant in the room. I'm also the only female member of Sally Vanilla. I wasn't always. When I first started out, Cherry was on the server and there was also a girl called Annabelle. Uh, but Annabelle left and then Cherry left and that, that left me. The, the last one. The last lady standing. But hopefully we'll, we'll change that soon and we'll have a few ladies on here. It's really nice to be on the fifth choice server and have the cherry patch ladies, including cherry, on here. Uh, you have... It helps if I actually type. Oh, no. The... I can't spell stone. Okay, there you go. You have discovered the shadow stone. This is going to be like one of those little um, little stone ritual circles that you get in Skyrim. So, going to try and rig this up with a with a dispenser on it. Didn't want to do that. And maybe put like a beacon or something in it, like just there. Maybe put some brown glass on there so it doesn't stand out quite so much. I don't know. Things to think about. Um, I kind of don't really want to go into my personality all that much because uh, it's kind of a bit depressing. Um, although I guess that could be one thing I talk about. Um, suffer from depression, have done for a while. Trying to <laughs> um, seeing people about it now. Um, so I have been feeling a lot better as of recently. So, yay. This is kind of awkward. <laughs> Endermen have been up here. If Optifine would uh, load that in, that would be wonderful. Someone been caving over there. Is that just the light source? That goes on for ages. Oh, the, oh no, that's a little, that's another little one. So we've got a nice dark oak forest there, and then we've got another one over there in between me and pigs. That's cool. Let's go and investigate that way I think of things to say. Although, I think, uh, oh, sorry for breathing into the microphone there. So I haven't got my professional stuff back yet. Um, here we go. Yeah, someone's been in here and been caving. Is it me and I've forgotten? Because it's been a long time. Is it me? I don't remember. So, yeah. This is my uh, first trying to get back into Minecraft thing after my accident. Um, probably going to be doing some more stuff. I'm not sure what series that going to be returning is Korra because I've still got a load of stuff recorded for that. It's infinitely easier for me to uh, use a controller at the moment rather than a 
mouse. But I'll see what I can do. I've played Life is Strange, that's going to finish in a couple of days. Until the next episode comes out, which is going to probably be in September sometime. I don't even know if I hit him, but whatever. Let's F5 it. So things will start getting back to normal on the channel very soon. Boulder's Gate will be returning. I don't know why I'm firing my arrow at you guys. Let's stop. Do I have a bare hand somewhere? No. Oh well, there we go. So, uh, so yeah, it's kind of a channel update. Who are my thing? Things are gonna start coming back out again. Baldur's Gate. I'm gonna try and finish that. Don't know if I'll go for the full 25 episode thing again. I kind of just want it done so I can do other stuff. So for now, I'm Page of Maces. Slowly getting better. Slowly making a comeback. So hope this episode wasn't too rambly and uh, disjointed, but I still I need I'm a bit rusty. So. I'll get the rhythm back again soon enough, so TTFN.